awesome guys, back in another video, so as we all know now, PewDiePie vs T-Series is a war that is just never going to end. T-Series for the past couple of weeks now, they've been going in front and behind of PewDiePie constantly, literally every other day. Well like two days ago, we thought it was all done and dusted when T-Series was 70,000 subscribers past PewDiePie. That's until PewDiePie released his video last night which has accumulated over 13 million views in under 22 hours. It's called Congratulations Essentially, a song congratulating T-Series for finally passing him. The war's done and dusted, but he was mocking them the entire time. As of recording, PewDiePie is now over 30,000 subscribers past T-Series, and the funniest thing about this, when T-Series thought they were done and dusted, they completely passed PewDiePie, no chance in hell he's coming back. They changed their YouTube banner claiming, oh, thank you guys, making us the number one most subscribed channel on YouTube. Now it's just a bit awkward. Like I was saying, in PewDiePie's song, he was exposing T-Series for multiple different things, Bring it to the public eye and here's what he actually said. Hey congratulations to your corporation. Guess you be one Swedish boy, you need a billion Asians. Yeah, you did it very nice and all it took was a massive corporate entity with every song in Bollywood. Now you're at number one. Hope you did nothing wrong like starting your business by selling pirated songs. Oops, didn't think we'd see. It's right there on Wikipedia. Get used to your past being held against you by the media. Uh -oh. This was a smart move by good old PewDiePie. He's regained the number one spot. He's edging closer to the 100 million subscriber mark. That's when the war is going to officially be ended, but that's not all we have to say. I'm sure right now there's nothing that you're doing that's illegal, yeah. I'm certain that you haven't had collusions with the mafia. For legal reasons, that's a joke. For legal reasons, that's a joke. For serious Indian mafia, please don't kill me, that's a joke. Pirating songs, tax evasion, Indian mafia, PewDiePie, he's clearly done his research. He knows what he's doing. The fact this comes from T-Series arch nemesis, it's going to hit home. It's going to take it personal. Now T-Series have to drop the diss track as a response. I got a letter in the post. Hmm, what is this? T-Series saying cease and desist. Had a problem with me telling them to hold their defecation. But let me educate you, silly. That's not defamation. T-Series can eat a dick. Still not defamation. Stuck my fucking Swedish meatball. Still not defamation. Did you know that Indians have poop -poo in their brains? That's a blatant racist lie. Yeah, but still not defamation. He then brings up the fact that T-Series mailed him some letter about some defamation cease and deceased. The fact T-Series is based in India, they made it all the way go to the UK. Probably took a month to do. They're trying to threaten PewDiePie against some legal cause. You know what? That right there is beta male mentality. So this is it. Thanks for sticking with my channel. Ever since I was a nobody screaming at barrels. Yeah, this is it. It's been an adventure. It's the end of the reign of Felix Arvid Ulf Schalberg. Through all the change and controversy, you've been by my side. There's no army in the world. I would rather give me a watch time. It's been a wild ride. So while I can still be heard, here's one last bro fist from the number one in the world. Whether you like him or not, PewDiePie has marketed this T-Series drama to the best potential level it could ever be to. T-Series went ahead of PewDiePie for a bit, they thought it was all over, changing their banner. Then PewDiePie drops his video exposing them for multiple different things. Three big things he's exposing them for. Now he's regained a spot. The nine-year-old army, they're going to come in clutch and ensure he gets the epic victory royale to 100 million subs. A news article released a response to PewDiePie's video titled PewDiePie is a sore loser after losing YouTube crown to T-Series. Clearly an Indian site that wrote this article. First off, PewDiePie has now regained the number one spot. And secondly, how is calling out a massive corporation for their illegal wrongdoings a trait of a sore loser? I mean, it just does make sense. The most recent member to join the battle against T-Series was the man himself, Quibblecop. He's got like 10 million plus subs. He released a video like half an hour ago where he said PewDiePie for over 24 hours. What a great man he is. Hopefully, Mr. Beast is going to come in clutch and come up with a viral video to ensure PewDiePie hits 100 million subs before T-Series. We're getting too close for comfort at the moment and action needs to be taken. Anyway guys, that's my brother video. I hope you all did enjoy. If you did, be sure to smash the like button, subscribe, and I'll see you later.